Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Convoy. This is uh, Abysmal, and last episode we were able to manage to salvage our run, got our vehicles back, and let's go ahead and continue that. We're going to work on some of the mainline objectives now, since we're doing a lot better with Rainbow Bright here, and uh, Railgun, and Dragon, and well, this little guy, he's going to help out. I think we're going to move around the weapons a little bit, though, because I want him to have, I want um, the guy that has the pulse later. Stupid pile of rust. Refresher, what? I don't need this. No, we go to camp, and <laughs> we have fuel. I don't know why that keeps... There we go. Let's see if that uh, comes up again. It should... It does. Okay. A panel breaks off, revealing a hidden cache of 13 gas. Wow. Well, that's a... That's nice. Nice little hookup. All right, so which one do we want to work on? Well, we already got the blue chip. We can go for flux capacitor, hyperdrive stabilizers. Um, we're going to go flux capacitor. Let's go ahead and start making our way that way. So we are able to get wood stock, which is a huge pickup for us. And finding even the little vehicle. And I did say I was going to switch the weapons out a little bit, but we'll do that eh, maybe next camp. So let's first get over here. There we go. Privateers have set up a roadblock up ahead. You are forced to stop and pay a fee. Well, I don't have your fee. That's a bit steep. Well, you know, let's talk to them. Let's see. That's a bit steep, isn't it? Uh, yeah, you're right. But you gotta aim high, you know. Tell you what. We'll make it 10 scrap. I don't even have that. <laughs> we'll just kill you. Uh, we're, we're gonna be fighting you. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got here. We got some guys in coming bottom left. This guy has a stunning device. I'm gonna see if I can stun him before he stuns me. Then we'll take him out. And this guy can work on this guy. This guy can work on this guy. We'll have the lasers coming down and work on these guys. Alright. Let's put... Let's put a mine right here. There we go. Bring our laser in. Oh, I think they're moving all the way right here, which is good. That works. And we're going to go ahead and leech off of one of these guys. Let's see who's going to be the best leech target. Maybe him. Everybody has a target they can hit. Yep, dragon, railgun. Everybody's hitting the target. That's good. And who are we going to stun next? Well, I'm actually thinking about maybe stunning this guy. Alright, they lost line of sight. He still has line of sight on him, but he's not really doing too much damage to him. So let's go ahead and try to take out this guy first. I'll throw a mine right here. Maybe do a little damage. Alright, so that took care of the first guy. Dragon now needs a target. We'll, we'll stick with that guy being the target. Let's bring these guys back now. Or at least bring one of them back. Taken and Woodstock is taking out this guy for us. That's good. That guy's dead. Stun this guy. All right, so there's some death coming up for some people. Um, if we can get him up here just in time. There we go. That should be good. All right, all these guys are down now. And that should be it. Let's see how we did with, um, looks like everybody's shields are doing pretty good. Dragon got hit a lot for his health. Uh, everybody's looking pretty good. So that was a good fight. We got 10 scrap, uh, 10 fuel and 36 scrap off of that. We also managed to obtain 108 scrap. Wow, you dismantle the roadblock and discover a hidden stash of parts. Hey, that's awesome. <laughs> So we have literally come from having two vehicles to having four vehicles and 146 scrap. Hey, I don't think we can do better than that. I kind of want to get to a camp though. Let's let's see if we can find a. Just because I want to get some of the weapons situated a little bit better, maybe make. I, I think I can buy some weapons from one of these places, and we'll go ahead and uh, attach them to some of the vehicles that need some more damage. You know, I know there's some. There, there's some areas I would like to improve on damage. Let's see. Come across a lone man wearing what seems to be a sandwich sign. Um, no, we'll approach him. 
He seems to be wearing a sign of the Lucky Peacock, the mysterious... Oh, yeah. So that's going to allow us to go again to the uh, gambling casino, which is great. We're going to do that again. But once we get a little bit more scrap. Um, we can do a little bit of repairs. We need a little bit of... We need a little bit of everything right now. Let's first see... This was where I got the... Um, the vehicle, so we'll just do some repairs. Uh, not a lot, just just enough to top us off a little bit. Also buy us a little bit of fuel. Let's get ourselves to our happy 50 number. There we go. Let's leave camp. And hmm, I still want I want to do the 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 actual quest for this flux capacitor. So let's make make our way over there. There we go. He didn't. Uh, then we just need to go get. Um, <laughs> we just need to go make our way over to his laboratory, and hopefully, there's not too much to that quest line. Uh, you come across KJ, uh, a, a KJL trading company caravan heading, uh, heading the other way. Since these are relatively safe lands, they seem to lack any arm. Okay, we'll we'll hail them. We only have 51 scraps. So there's nothing to really buy from them. Uh, what can we do for you? Ask to buy something, threaten them, wish them luck, and continue. Well, we'll ask to buy something. I don't really... Yeah, Tantra, we don't... Ah, uh, should we just kill them? This is so bad. Normally, I would like to buy some of their... Some of their things. Hmm. Now, we're going to be nice. We're going to be nice. Let's just keep moving. I'm just feeling generous today. Just because everything uh, we, we got out of the last... Uh, episode really really helped us out so I'm just feeling uh, I want to contribute back there are only so many ways to describe sand and at this point you ran out of them <laughs> okay let's see what's here you return to the professor's laboratory laboratory head inside um, upon entering the laboratory you find the professor sleeping behind a cluttered desk his head resting on a pile of scribbled notes he suddenly wakes up and ex exclaims technology uh, oracles not on my watch before not noticing you he then continues ah you're back got the parts then yes what we'd agreed upon again pretty sure it was 50 right <laughs> yeah completely right 50 sure that's gonna give us another piece hopefully we're gonna get in a battle because we're getting low on fuel haha -ha, great pleasure doing business I'll go prepare the flux capacitor, and yeah, he's going to be able to get it. So that's two pieces. We need to make our way over to the ship and drop this stuff off. So that's two pieces now, and I only need two more pieces to finish off, get off this planet, never see it again. No, we'll probably end up doing it on hard mode after this. <laughs> so let's make our way to the ship. Get on the road. Onwards. Yep. I'm hoping we get in a battle here real soon because we really need to feel. I I can't even justify going to the ship right now. Three, two, yeah, we're. This isn't great. We need to figure out what we can do. We need fuel. There's nothing. There's nothing we can do about that. You know, we just need fuel. But we'll we'll make uh our way to. Well, let's do the hyperdrive. That's going to be Andy, I believe. So we're going to take on Andy Bros. Um, we're going to attack everyone. What? What? Now I have no fuel. No. No, no. Uh, stranded without fuel for quite some time when you hear the roar of engines. We have no choice. Do it. Okay, he takes you away from the others and tells you that he might be able to create some biofilm made out of the crew. Oh, there's no guarantee it'll work. But it's your best shot right now. Uh, no, I don't. I don't like that. I don't like that. No. Leaves leaves to think uh, of some new ideas. Meanwhile, you remain stranded without any fuel. Hopefully, that doesn't end our run. I'm hoping we get a better scenario. There we go. You broadcast your emergency signal for some time. Uh, open radio channels. Uh, it does not take long for the dust cloud. Uh, they appear to be a civilian vehicle. Let's hear it. Greetings, strangers. Down on your luck. We heard your emergency signal and decide to, to have a look. Um, how about we give you 18 fuel to help you back on your way? Um, yeah. 
Sounds great. Ooh, thank you. The civilian uh, vehicles deposit the fuel to your convoy. Pleasure to help. We gotta look out for each other on a planet like Omec Prime. Thank you. Goodbye. Yeah. That was a big, uh, you know, I, I didn't want to sacrifice my crew members. I'm not going to do that. Just, I mean, that's just wrong. They've been with me so long. I've been doing so many great things for me. I just need a battle. Need a fight. No, we're not. Uh, thank you. Well, ah, uh, it seems you've driven straight into a stand, sandstorm. There is a fair risk of losing contact with one. This is the same thing that happened to me before. I have no fuel to go around it. Uh, <laughs> Eventually the storm passes, you manage to recover. Oh, okay, thank god. This is awful. We're getting in no battles. Alright. Yeah, oh dear. Wow. Damn. This is not good. This fuel thing is becoming a real problem. Several vehicles approach your convoy, but stay out of reach of your vehicle. Uh, evidently, they're aware of your fuel troubles. Uh, they, you try to start your engines with the last drops of fuel you have remaining to counterattack. Ah, let's do this. Come on. Thank God it's a fight, but man, we really took a lot of damage on that. Let's see. We've been this way. Sometimes the game just does not gift you everything, I'll tell you that. Oh, I got stunned. Okay, our laser is back online and we can hit this guy back here or we can try to go that way. Let's think about where we want to... Yeah, I think we'll just put it here. There we go. At least get one of these guys out of here. Hmm... Let's see if we can just throw it right there. Okay, that's one. This guy's really getting hurt, and should, and so is he. I mean, they're both really, really hurting right now. Okay, let's see if we can get him out of here. I'm really hoping we can take out this guy in the front here before he takes out my guy. He already took him out. Dang it. Eh, yeah, well. We lost the vehicle. That had a lot to do with the fact that we had so low on fuel that it was causing us major problems. Alright. I really don't even want to bring my small guy into any range of this right now. Oh, he just got stunned again. Where's the stunner guy at? Oh, it's back here. I'll get him next time. I don't want to even bring him in range right now. If I bring this guy in range, I'm going to have a lot of problems. Let's first uh, see if we can get ourselves a, a mine on him. Yep, we did. Hmm. Let's get rid of this zapper guy. Alright, we are going to survive. We lost a vehicle, but that's okay. Uh, I expect to lose... I didn't, ex I, I didn't expect to go so long without a fight and not get any fuel. That's kind of sucks. I moved. That is so wrong. <laughs> wow, okay, so we got... Wow, all the attackers, attackers have been defeated. You managed to find 27 fuel in addition 70 scrap. That's actually a good pickup. But, unfortunately, we do have to go to another camp. And we, that's way, that's right back there. Where's the... Spaceship is 137. 133. Hmm. Well, let's go back to camp. We have to do it. We have to buy fuel and repair a little bit. This game, it's like a, it's like a roller coaster. One second you're doing great, the next second you're doing bad. <laughs> Alright. Keep going. Alright, so we made it to camp. Let's get a little bit of repairs in. There we go. Now we gotta do a little bit more. 
that might be good enough. Yeah, I think that'll be good enough. So let's see what's in the shop anyways. Um, I'm, I'm probably not going to be able to buy any of this right now, but I just want to see what's here. We got a medium rocket artillery, which might be good. So we lost a railgun out of all that. Hmm. I'm going to put the light rocket artillery down here. Then I'm going to take this laser, put it down here. Oh, what we want to do is put this... Yeah, that that should be. I, I'm gonna think of that's gonna be a better weapon for that guy. At least he's gonna be able to hit from range, hit over vehicles, and so he won't because he he doesn't have a lot of hit points. He doesn't have a lot, so it's gonna be good for him to shoot over things where he can get out of line of sight of other vehicles. All right, and then we'll buy the rest fuel. Everything we can. Hmm. What is this one? Oh, you know. Oh, is that the peacock? I think that's the peacock. Yeah, we don't we don't want to gamble yet. So hyperdrive still. Um, I don't think we can do it right now. I want to get fully repaired, but we'll make our way over there. Maybe there's a camp close by. I don't know. Investigate the wreck. We get 89 scrap. That's great. Still running out of fuel, which we probably should have went and bought fuel. But I'm hoping for. Normally we get in an attack. We're not getting any instances of attacks. We're d it's happening to us again. Stupid pile of rust. Yeah, damn. Yeah. Let's hear it. Uh, whoa. Because you might be able to take apart some non-essential parts of one of your vehicles and turn it into fuel. Uh, there's a risk it will be destroyed, however. No, 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 no. We can't take that risk. Leaves think of some new ideas. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. There'll be an uh, one that will give us a better, a better thing. You spot a dust? Yeah. Radio them. We could buy fuel. This is perfect. Eighteen fuel for thirty. That's not bad, I guess. And uh, that's gonna get it. Yeah, that's fine. Or forty-five. You know, that's fine. We'll do, we'll, we'll do that because, thanks. That's gonna let us go to a point of interest. There's a radio signal originated from a lone man carrying a uh, radio beacon. What do you need? Hi, fellas. My name is Guy. I need some help. What do you need? Oh, it's the plague. The plague. My cousin, the plague. Yeah. We don't care. I, I'm actually... You know what? I'm going to do it. I don't care. Let's do this. You arrive in a shady part of town. You're a crew member assures you that the milk bar should be around here. Look around. Head over to the tramp. Ignore the tramp. Eh, no, eh, let's head over to the tramp. Explain you're looking for the milk bar. Ask, what's so stinking about it? Ignore the tramp. No. I just want to go that way. Great. Enter the milk bar. Yep. The bar has furniture in the shape of naked women. Uh, everybody's drinking from <laughs> from the women. I remember that. Talk to the man. Tell him more. All right. Okay. It's been a while since I've been. I've seen some lashing of the ultra violence, which is where you come in. Okay. How about I lash? Uh, see, we're just gonna take on him. How about I lash towards you? This is the Andy fight. We're just gonna go ahead and lash out at him. Basically, he says, "Oh, I'm really uh." I'm really happy to see you guys want to take me on and things like that. So we're just going to go ahead and do it. Uh, let's team up. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, well, let's team up then. Well, what he says. Okay. Oh, that is wonderful. While I applaud your enthusiasm, if you kill me now, you'll never find the hyperdrive stabilizer. However, I like your thinking. If you want to fight me on uh, head on, then I, that can be arranged. Me and my druids have a private squad just outside of town. Defeat us and you get the hyperdrive stabilizer. Sound good, right? Uh, I feel obliged to warn you that my private squadron is not to be trifled with. I am somewhat of a peacekeeper, you see. Wouldn't want to keep you from that. <laughs> no. Keep that from me. Okay, let, let's uh, let's team up then or bring it on. Um, I think we're going to bring it on, bud. <laughs> Andy looks the light. Absolutely sure. I will shoot to kill and trust you do the same. Okay. Yeah, yes. I'm sure. Let's go. Alright. And let's just do this. Alright, that's fine. 
All right, Andy, here we go. Not in the best of wares, but we will be okay, I think. We're going to all want to focus. Actually, let's see if we can all... We're going to keep one guy stunned. Nah, we're not, they got shields, so they're not going to stay stunned. Let's just go ahead and all focus on one guy. The other thing we're going to do is possibly... Okay, I got stunned. I'm going to move my dragon over here. Okay. There we go. It's alright, we're taking a little damage. We need to guard our SUV a little bit better. Just leech off of him. Alright, let's start focusing maybe on him. There we go. We did some pretty good damage right there. They're doing damage to me though too though. And I don't... Gotta get in some of my guys to prevent some of this damage, block it. There we go. Oh, my laser's back up right when my guy came up. Okay, there he is. <laughs> Alright, we're doing okay. Looks like Andy's dying, so that's good. Yeah, we're doing, we're doing work. Not the best work. I can't believe he still can shoot me through that little crack, but oh well. Okay. I gotta start moving our dragon out of here because our dragons get... Oh! There's an opportunity. There we go. That took care of him. Alright, now we just need to get in range of this guy. And normally I'd like to just run these guys in the wall, but I think we're going to be okay not doing that. I'm going to keep my... Oh my god, he still can hit me from there. Wow. We're getting our we're getting our dragon out of here. That's all I know. It's time to get him out of here. I don't want to lose our dragon over this, so we'll move him way up front. Okay. Throw another thing here. Doing decent. Doing decent. We wish we'd do a little bit better, but we're doing decent. His shields are down. Everything's down right now. That's good. All right, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. We're gonna win this right now. Yeah. No, oh, I got stunned. He's going off. He's not gonna make it. Yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> awesome. Okay. After blasting uh, Andy's final vehicle, you wait for him to crawl out of the wreck. He approaches your convoy uh, while laughing loudly, despite being covered in blood and bruises. Amazing. That was great. Well fought. Oh my brother. Well fought. Ask about the hyperdrive stabilizer. Uh. I had not forgotten. Arrangements have been made and route to your location as we speak. Thanks for the little fight. I haven't felt this alive in years. Consider yourself a friend of Andy and his druids. After a while, a transport a vehicle a transport vehicle approaches your location and delivers a hyperdrive. Yep, awesome. I am in dire need though, probably. <laughs> we got 16 fuel, 50 scrap. We need to find a nearest camp, which is kind of far. Spaceship is kind of far. Everything's kind of far, and we're not. The the our our dragon knight is really in dire needs. Okay, wait. Let's see. Come across a trading company caravan heading. Uh, we'll we'll hail them. I wonder if we could buy some fuel from them. Has to buy something. Um. We'll just kill him? Uh, I need the fuel. Yeah. Okay. You open fire and blast the KJL transport vehicles to smithereens. A handful of the crew, crew members have escaped their vehicles and are fearfully awaiting their fate. Uh, leave them them be and loot the wrecks. Yeah, that's what I need. Well, great. Now, now let's leave. Okay, so we got the shield and we got the heavy, super heavy railgun. We needed both of those things, but still in need of fuel. Hopefully we get back to camp. I don't think we will, but if we can make it to camp, we are going to be okay, but I don't think we are. <laughs> it looks like a little too far. It's all right. There it is. Okay. Uh, you broadcast your emergency signal, uh, open radio channels. You open radio channels. It does not take long for a dust uh, cloud to contact you. They appear to be a civilian vehicles. Yes. <laughs> How does 
50 scrap for 22. Yes, that's it's a deal. Thank you. <laughs> uh, thanks. Goodbye. Okay, let's get let's let's get ourselves back to camp here. Come on. Now you can make it. There we go. Now that's good. Now we're in a good position. We only have one more piece uh, to get. We're, we're having difficulty getting there, but we still have three vehicles. I think we can do the last quest. Um, I don't know how we're going to fare against the boss, but I think we can do the last quest pretty good. And now that we got some more, now this is a great weapon to put on our MCV and a good shield too. So we'll do that. But I think we need to sell some of it. But we're going to first arrange things to where we can. So first off, I'm going to replace this guy with a shield. That's fine. We're going to sell this item. Get 20 scrap. Now, I am going to keep this weapon, but I'm going to change it out for one of these. So let's see, what do we want to change out? The mine layer? Yeah, that should get us some fuel. There we go. So now we're at 40 scrap, which we probably, need, but we really, we, there's a couple things we need to do. So what, what things do we really need to do? We need to repair the dragon, definitely. We had, do have to think about selling something else. But what is it that we're going to sell? I don't know. Looks like everybody's in a in fair shape now. What can we sell? The leech drone and the EMP? No, nah, I need all those. I'm going to keep all that. The shield. And we can sell this heavy... You know what? I might just sell this heavy plasma. Deal with this guy only having one weapon for now. And then... Uh, and then possibly get a better weapon for him later. We have to buy some fuel. Alright. Well, that should do it for this episode, though. We did complete two... Uh, two or three, actually. Well, we got three pieces total so far. And... Next episode, we'll find uh, we'll get the final piece that we need, and then it's on to the final boss. So that should be good. I hope to see you guys next time. I hope you guys haven't been enjoying these videos. If you do, please hit the like button, and see you guys next time. Take it easy.